Well, it doesn't get much tougher than the last episode, guys. We had Barcelona and Bayern Munich in a row. It was a really, really tough set of fixtures. And we got extremely unlucky with injuries, as you know. Have a look at this. We've had three major injuries recently. Gaetan has just recovered from a broken ankle. He's back in training. But Williams and Griezmann both broke their ankle in the last episode, which absolutely sucks. Griezmann is going to be out pretty much for the rest of the season. He should be just about back in time for maybe the Champions League final if we get there. So really, really unlucky with some injuries there. I seem to be extremely unlucky with injuries in general, but... Either way, guys, we've got a couple of league games coming up. We've then got the second leg against Bayern in the Champions League. It's only going to get tougher from here on out, and we've got a lot of fixtures to get through. We are going away from home to Deportivo. They're in the bottom three. I thought we probably would get a win in this match. There you go. Juan Fran scores the goal 66 minutes in, and that means that's one fixture down. We're one fixture closer to the really big one, of course, and that's Bayern Munich. But first, we've got to play Valencia. I think it's at home. It is at home. They are in the top four. Oh, no, they've dropped out of the top four. They're now in fifth, but they do have a game in hand on Malaga. So if Valencia beat us today, that would be a great result for them. We're top of the league, and we've got two games in hand. So it's a must win for both of us. This is going to be a tough game. And already, guys, the injuries are causing me issues. They really are. The, the team selection is really different today. I've actually go... Had to go with the Dharma up front. So Cancelo plays on the right wing. Vishalko coming in on the right mid. We just literally played that game against Deportivo two days ago. So a lot of my players are exhausted. I need the likes of Williams and Griezmann and Gaitan who still can't be played. It really sucks. It really does. But that is a very strong Valencia team. You can see why they would be up there in that top six. But I am going to win this game. Even though we're playing a Dharma up front, I reckon he's going to do really well for us. Here's Carrasco now into Adama. Ball over the top. That's a lovely pass. He's going to have to turn back, though. Now get the cross in. He gets it in this time. Carrasco wins the header. Wow. And just like that, guys, we are 1-0 up. Who needs Williams? Who needs Griezmann when you've got Carrasco, Adama, and Cancelo? Vishalko doing really well to get the cross in as well. Yeah, I'm joking. I miss Griezmann already. I really do. It just shows you when you lose your key players... You just, you have a hole in your team, don't you? But there we go, 1-0 up. Now I just need to keep a clean sheet and score a few more, hopefully. We have a corner. Let's whip this one in with Koke. Good delivery. Godin's there. Wow, that was very, very close to going in. A big save from Diego Alves there. Should have It should have been 2-0. Oh, I've missed the tackle. This could be dangerous. I need Jimenez to get back as well. Come on, win that. Yes, Godin using his strength there. Godin is a leader he really is now can we get on one last attack in this first half no i've just given it away and that should be half time valencia really struggling to uh to get on the attack they seem to be you know having a lot of possession but not doing anything with it here's carrasco straight away in the second half into coke he gets tackled on the edge of the box this is going to be a very good opportunity it's a yellow card for santos and can coke capitalize on this opportunity come on go on go on go on not a good free kick. I just don't seem to score them with this team. Let's throw this to Saul. Now over to Koke. Get out of the way, ref. Into Saul again. Into Adama. Through ball for Carrasco. He's in. And he scores. Game over, guys. Valencia are not coming back from that. Lovely build-up play. Adama gets the assist. But look at that defending from Santos. Koke. Through ball for Adama. I mean, I know he's quick. Oh, my God. He's actually going to get there. What? Finesse it. Oh my god, freaking hell! How did he get there? Shocking defending and in off the post. Adama playing up front gets a goal. 3 0. Wow, what a game. Well, we're going into extra time. Three minutes. I don't think that's long enough for them to score four goals, do you guys? But it might be long enough for me to get one more and make it 4 0. Through ball. It's lovely. Carrasco. In the box now for Cancelo. No! Abdenor, who came on at left back late on, did really well to defend that. But guys, we've completely destroyed them. What a game. Things are looking pretty good for us right now, guys. We're four points clear at the top of the league. We've got a game in hand on Barcelona. Madrid have a game in hand as well, so they're going to get a bit tighter to us. Um, actually, I tell you what, that Madrid versus Barcelona game could be absolutely huge in deciding who's going to be the real title contenders along with us because it can't be both of them. I think, honestly, one of them is going to start to 
to climb a little bit ahead of the other. But we're doing really well at the moment. We've got two games coming up before the Bayern game. One of them is Sporting Gijon down in 19th place with just 14 points this season. So that should be another easy win. Although it is an away game, it could go badly wrong. No, it hasn't. And look at that, it's the same as last time. Juan Fran makes it 1-0 and we go on and win the game. We're getting very lucky with the fixtures once again, guys. We're playing a lot of the lower league teams in a row. This time Granada away from home down in 16th. Correa makes it 1-0 early on and wow, Hernandez got sent off, but we still managed to get another goal and win the game 2-0. We are on fire right now, guys. No team is beating us. But this is the reason I've been simulating a few games, guys. We all want to get to the big games. Bayern at home, the second leg of round of 16. We've got to beat them today. Well, actually, no, technically we can get a draw and still go through. But obviously, I want to get a good performance and I want to win again. Beating Bayern 1-0 at the Allianz Arena was not easy. We had to defend an awful lot in that game. We actually went to a five-at-the-back formation in the second half. I'm hoping today... It's going to be a little bit easier. We're at home. I'm going to be playing really attacking football. I'm going to try and hold on to the ball as much as possible and keep a clean sheet. If Bayern score, things get a little bit tougher. So just don't concede, right? Very similar team as the game against Valencia. Although we do have Gamero coming in. Cancelo drops down to that right mid. So Adama comes in on the right wing. No um, Vashalko today, although he did really, really well for us. Now here's the Bayern team. It looks pretty much exactly the same as the first leg. Lewandowski up front with Oscar behind him. Robin, Ribéry, Cavalio, Alonso. Very strong defence. Here we go, guys. This is a big one. If we get a 0-0 draw, we go through to the quarterfinals. But of course, I want to score. I want to play attacking football. Here's Adama. Through ball. Oh, yes. Come on, Cancelo. Use that pace. Carrasco's in the box. He's in. Carrasco's in. He's off the post. You're kidding me. Oh, that is so unlucky. Making it 2-0 so early would have been brilliant, but we've got the ball back again. Adama's going to hit this, and yeah, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Oh, so close, guys. Now here come Bayern. Lewandowski goes through way too easily. Oh my god, Godin. I tackled Lewandowski with Godin's back. That was lucky. So we've been unlucky to hit the post, but then extremely lucky to win that tackle. Here's Alexandro. Passes it inside for Gamero. Through for Carrasco, hits it. And Alaba, what a tackle that is. He's world class. One last attack before half time. Sandro goes through. Try to get across in. Oh, it was a little bit too late. Or a little bit too early, I should say. The, the run was a little bit late. And I think that's going to be half time. Oh, actually, no, we get one more chance. Here's Gamero, hit it. Oh, he's hit the bar. It's actually come off the bar, guys. Okay, we've hit the post, we've hit the bar. We're playing well, so I'm pretty sure we are going to get a goal in this second half. But you just never know. I'm going to leave things as they are, though. The team is performing well. Okay, switching the play out here for Cancelo. Through for Adama. Wasn't a bad pass, but it's been cut out. We get another try here with Koke. Over to Carrasco. Finesse it. Go on. Oh, you're kidding me. It's another chance. So, so close to finding the back of the net. Let's have a look how close this really was. Carrasco is good at these, and it's actually a lot worse than I thought. Oh no, Philip Lahm's through. Oh, Philip Lahm scored, but it's offside. Is it offside? No, it's not. I thought for a second it was offside. Oh, he's shushing me. <sighs> Damn it, man. Philip Lahm, of all people, he never scores. And he's just cut through me way too easily here with a 1 2 with, uh, with Lewandowski. Okay, well, the best thing I can do now, guys, is just score again, because right now it's going to extra time. I'm going to have to change it up. Jota's coming on, Gabby's coming on. Gamero is exhausted. He's got literally no fitness left. His, uh, his fitness bar was all the way down at zero. Oh, I'll take that. Thank you very much. Jota picks it up straight away here. Put it through for Carrasco. We might be on the attack straight away here. We normally do come back after conceding, so maybe we can get lucky again. Cancelo's won that. Come on, Cancelo. Hit it. Neuer saves it. The rebound comes out to Carrasco. He keeps it in. Get the cross in. Go on, Koke. And Vidal clears it. Come on, we've got time. What the hell is Boateng doing on the left wing? I think they're on all-out attack right now, and it's working. It's very stressful to play against. Here's Lewandowski holding up the ball well. Oscar loses it. Right, can we get on the break again? Up here to Carrasco. Come on, Carrasco. Use that pace against Philip Lahm. Philip Lahm is not very quick. Carrasco is 
Square it. Surely that's a goal. Come on, Adama. Yes. There's the goal we needed, guys. Eight minutes to go. It wasn't meant for Adama. That pass was not meant to go as far as him. I was looking for Cancelo, I think that is, but it worked in the end. Neuer beating at his near post. What a goal that could be. Very, very important. I'm doing it again. I don't care what people say. I'm going five at the back. It worked when we played against them away from home. It just shut up shop and it made it much harder for Bayern to break through. So hopefully it works again with five minutes to go. And then we hit them on the counter whenever we get the ball. Here's Adama. He's the hero so far. Try and get this in for Jota. Jota's in. What a strike. He got so much power on that, but big save from Neuer. That really would have been game over. But to be honest, I've got the ball. I don't think they're going to be able to score. Only three minutes of added time. Put that through for Sandro. Get the cross in. Go on, Adama. Hummels heads it out. One more cross, maybe. Oh, shit. Blow the whistle. Yes, come on. We've beaten arguably the strongest team in the game, along with Madrid, Barcelona, you know what I mean, Juventus as well, maybe. But we've beaten a very, very tough team. We're through to the quarterfinals. Oh, that was intense. And here are the other results. So Porto looks like they've knocked out Juventus. Barcelona knocking out PSG there. Tottenham have knocked out Real Madrid. Wow, Lyon have knocked out Dortmund. Every single team there... Except from maybe the fixture with PSG and Barcelona, the underdog has gone through. That's incredible. Um, we've got some other teams going through. Roma, Leverkusen, us, and Napoli and City there. It looks like it's gone to penalties and I can't see who's won. But some of the big teams have been knocked out. The one team I'm obviously going to be very cautious about is Barcelona and probably Tottenham, to be honest. They've got a very strong team. What a signing Adama has turned out to be already. We just won six million euros for progressing through to the quarterfinals and Adama didn't even cost us that much. So, and he won us the game. If you see what I mean, he effectively paid for himself with that goal, which is pretty awesome. He's only 21 as well, so he's going to grow. He really will. He's already 75. We picked him up at 74 rated. But statistically, although I've got him in training now and uh, I'm improving his shooting... He could be a very good striker for us while Griezmann is out injured. But to be honest, now that Gaitan is available for selection, I'm thinking Carrasco goes up front and Gaitan out on the left side. But we've still got Adama and he's going to be fantastic for us. So in the next episode, guys, we are going to be finishing off March with a game against Sevilla, who started off the season so, so well. They were unbeaten for quite a while, um, but they haven't done so well since. They're not even in the top six, as you can see there. And then we've got probably the biggest month so far, April. There's, I think, nine fixtures, including the quarterfinals of the Champions League and a game against Real Madrid, which is going to be extremely important. We'll also have a retro report on Juan Fran, which will be at the end of every episode now. Whenever I do a retro report, it'll be at the end of the episode. So for the people that don't really care about it, it'll be at the end. We'll also be doing goal of the month for March. So uh, we've got some contenders for sure. So thank you for watching, guys. Hopefully you're enjoying this series. If you are, please do hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe as well. Follow me on Twitter at OfficialMGH, and I will see you next time.